So you could be on a treadmill, you could be on a bike, you could be jumping rope, you could be swimming laps, whatever it is, we're going to do a certain amount of time. So that's about 20, take a break. So this is just a classic interval training day. And, you know, if you look up interval training on, on, on Google, it'll give you a million hits, right? There's a lot of ways to do this. All right, so here we go. Start exercising again. So we're getting up. We're going, we're, we're, we're getting more intensity. We're doing something that's safe, right? Um, exercise is not dangerous. It's not dangerous. If you feel like you're going to fall, then you need to do something else. Right? But we're going up for 20 seconds, and then we're going to rest for 20. So that's about 20. Take a break. See what we're doing? We're going up, coming down. Coming up, coming down. Exactly. 
Jackie, since you're the boss, everywhere we go, <laughs> are we on the right or left? Okay. We're on the right. Okay, so I'm going to ask you to be my model. I'll okay. be your model, yep. Right. So we're just going to flip the water, flip it on the right, flip it on the left, flip it on the right, flip it on the left. And you said it's left. I said right. Oh, you said right. You haven't used some short-term memory. <laughs> no, this is weird. Okay, so let's do two flips on the right. Thank you. 
And I needed to share one quick thing. Yeah. A, a Rotarian, I needed to go and train him. I'm training him at 9 o'clock. He was a Rotarian. He said, please use me as an example. He has Parkinson's. He's changed so much. His name is Luke McCormick. And he said that the day he walked into the gym, he thought his life was done because he had been diagnosed. And guess what? Luke is vibrant, lifting heavy weights, doing burpees. And it's all because of the so yes. that's, Wow. That's an example. That's story. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Well, David and Jackie, thank you so much. What a fabulous story. Usually we have time for questions, but we've run out of time. So I hope you can stick around and maybe answer questions um, afterwards. We cannot. You cannot. I'm okay. Sorry. Well, we'll get you contact you information. But I have sure. information and my card's there. Yes. Yep. Please Perfect. call me. Okay. Don't email, just call me. I'll call I tell you what, yeah, I we think... still pick up our phones. We still answer yeah, our phones. We do. Yay. And so. you guys have really set our minds thinking about what's important. So thank you so very and much. And just let you know, if you guys ever have an exercise day, if you don't want to exercise next to Ingrid, she's really strong. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> All right. And with that, let's just wrap up. Next week's speaker is Dwight Smith. He'll be talking about my special word. It's going to be a very interesting program. I also wanted to tell you, if you have nothing to do this weekend, I think we all deserve to relax a little bit. And Sundays at Scioto, they have the Seven Bridges, the ultimate Eagle tribute band, Sunday at 14, 6.30, So it's free. And lastly, I quote, the doctor of the future will give no medicine, but will interest his patients in the care of the human brain in diet and in the cause of Thanks, guys. Thanks, guys. Okay. Uh, over here. Okay. So, what the heck? Why can't it be the same? <laughs> Yeah, I almost think that um, six. So it's hardly worth it. Yeah. Like we'll, I'll say all the time about like your experience with like yeah. it's like kind of It is. It is. It's 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 not. I can see it in the winter. So maybe we do just take a break for the next. We lose Aaron Prescott, who's a really good new member, but. Um, yeah, the other option is we skip the owl and we just use this and, and just best efforts. Like we can even set this up on the podium and she'd be able to hear what's going on. Yeah. But do you think these two strings are different? It's like, you know, so is there like 
Kent brought his own projector. Do you remember him doing that? I do remember that, yes. And I was just thinking, was that easier than these two screens? Because I feel like the two screens mess us up too. Uh, or not necessarily. Well, they do occasionally, but it's also just the, it's like the screen mirroring. I don't know why that's. I loved it. 